A signature piece of legislation by House Republicans is expected to come up for a vote this week. The Parents' Bill of Rights Act aims to give parents more control over their child's education. Senate Democrats are pushing back, arguing the bill is about politics. Fox News correspondent Lauren Blanchard reports from Washington. After two years of protests and calls for change at local school boards across the country, House Republicans are moving one step closer to fulfilling a key campaign pledge. Debate began Thursday on the Parents' Bill of Rights Act, which aims to give parents more control over their child's education by providing them access to what books are made available to students in the library and classroom and allow them to see how schools spend money. This is about promoting transparency. It is our job, it is our responsibility to protect our children from the evils being taught in some classrooms across the country. Democratic lawmakers opposed the measure, arguing it would lead to book bans and limit a child's education. It does not promote parent-teacher partnerships. It just creates division in our school. In 2020, the coronavirus pandemic placed a renewed focus on public school education. With remote learning, many parents grew concerned over the material being presented to their children. Children. In response, Republican governors in states like Florida, Texas, and Iowa have pushed forward similar legislation, which gave parents more involvement in their kids' schools. Unfortunately, there are some school districts that are teaching our children inappropriate things. Republican-led legislatures are going on a censorship spree that would make the Chinese Communist Party blush. A final vote in the House on this legislation is expected on Friday. It has little chance of being passed in the Senate. In Washington, Lauren Blanchard, Fox News.